Hi everyone, my name is Rachel. That's the R in the RK Stumbling Bear. I am a reader and a writer. And today I'm here to talk about Mexican Gothic by Silvia Moreno Garcia. This is a book that is not in my typical genre. I'm not a horror fan at all. Do not like watching horror movies or reading horror books because those ideas get stuck in my head when I'm trying to go to sleep and then keep me awake all night. I know I'm a lightweight. My husband teases me about this all the time. But I read my first Sylvia Moreno Garcia book last fall, um, The Gods of Jade and Shadow, and I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed her writing style. And then Mexican Gothic was nominated for the Nebulas, and I was like, okay, I guess I'm picking this up to read it. Yeah. So I picked it up. And I had watched some videos, so I had an idea of what was coming, which made it a lot better for me. Since I don't mind spoilers, it was great that I was able to have those warnings and help me. it helped me from not freaking out too much about the book. And overall, I actually really enjoyed this book, even if it is a horror. And I think in this book, again, Moreno Garcia's writing really shown. That's something I love about her is the way she engages the audience as she is showing us the world and what the characters are doing. So her writing is definitely my favorite part about her books. It makes me just want to read her entire backlist as well as anything that's coming out in the future. I really enjoyed Noemi as a character. So I didn't like how she referred to herself as silly in vain especially when she acts like that because of how society is. That's what they expect. And she uses that as a way to move throughout society. For her to think of herself as those things, it took away from her character for me. Overall, I loved her. I think she was a great heroine. And I like in the conclusion, you, Moreno Garcia tipped on the head, the concept of who saves whom that you would see in most fairy tales. And I, I just like how she played with those dynamics that I really enjoyed it. So yeah, I enjoyed this book way more than I thought I was going to, and it actually made five stars for me. And I think it might end up being one of my favorites of this year. At least so far, it's one of my favorites of this year. The main cover is gorgeous. So if you have read this book, please leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought of it. Thank you and have a good day.